In this video, I'll be reacting an ammonia solution with iodine crystals to form a contact explosive called nitrogen triiodide. To start, I put 100ml of 10% ammonia solution into a conical flask. I'm also using a plastic container, so if it does explode, it won't fire glass shrapnel everywhere. I poured around 25ml of ammonia solution into my plastic container. I added a spatula of iodine into the solution. While it remains wet, nitrogen triiodide is moderately stable. However, when dry, even a mosquito landing on it could set it off. You might be able to see bubbles coming off the iodine crystals. These are from the following reaction. The nitrogen triiodide is filtered off and the ammonia can be used for next time. After waiting for a minute, the solution is completely filtered. I took the nitrogen triiodide outside to dry out. I made another batch of nitrogen triiodide, but this time, instead of filtering it, I just decanted off the fluid. Here is a model of nitrogen triiodide. Nitrogen triiodide is so unstable because the iodine atoms find it hard to bond with the nitrogen because they are so big in comparison. This results in an explosive decomposition reaction which creates nitrogen gas and iodine gas. When two nitrogen atoms combine, they create a lot of energy to make nitrogen gas which is a molecule of N2. 